What's up, Ravens fans? We're now in the second week of training camp. We've been able to see the guys out there on the field to get our early impressions. And you guys have lots of questions, as you always do. Let's jump right into them. The first question today is from Sports Talk 9595. And Ryan, the question is, which players have been most impressive during the offseason and now into training camp? I'll give you three names. Number one, Eric Weddle. Number two, Dennis Pitta. Number three, here's a curveball for you. Running back Terrence West. And I'll start from the top. I mean, the leadership that Weddle has provided already. He's really changing the back end of this defense, and I think he'll he'll do a good job of that all season long. Number two, Dennis Pitta. We weren't sure how his hip was going to be. Not only has he remained healthy, but he's picked up where he left off from the Super Bowl year with Joe Flacco. The chemistry is still there. It doesn't seem like he missed any time. No, yeah, it's, it's incredible. N number three, Terrence West. I mean, here's a guy who's battling for a roster spot and and making a very good bid so far. He makes cuts that no other back makes. He's in phenomenal shape. He's a big guy, physical runner. Uh, I think he is going to have a – coaches are going to have a hard time cutting this guy if he continues at this pace. And I'll just throw out one more name, Kamalai Correa, yeah. the rookie the inside rookie. linebacker, taking a lot of reps with that first-team defense. He is somebody to watch this summer. All right, our second question comes from Facebook, and it's from Antoine. The question is, will the Ravens have a top-10 defense this year? Yeah. I think so. And if you talk to every player on this defense, defensive coordinator Dean Pease, all of them will tell you not only do they expect to be top 10, but they're talking top five, top, top three, three. Yeah, top <laughs> one. You know, they this is a group that has a lot of pride. Yeah. And I think that they've made the moves this offseason to put themselves in position to do that. Eric Weddle, you talked about him. Mm -hmm. The influx of, influx of rookies, Kamala like Correa. You have Ron, more pass rushers. You have more pass rushers. Terrell Suggs, by the way, he's coming back. Elvis Dumerville had a little cleanup procedure. You go kind of through this team, right. and there's a lot of guys with something to prove all up and down the defense. To me, it's, it's the improvement in the secondary makes a big difference. I mean, last year, you had a number 10 run defense in the NFL, so that really wasn't a problem. It was the pass defense giving up too many big plays in the first half of the season. But the second half, they were the best secondary in football. So if they can roll that over plus improve with the Weddle addition and Webb's transition, I think that they're a very, very good defense. Totally agree. Last question comes from at JT59. And they ask, would the team ever consider doing another season of Hard Knocks on HBO? I think that they would consider it, <laughs> but they would not want it. And, and really when I say they, I, I think head coach John Harbaugh would probably be more able to be convinced to bring it on, even though I don't think he would love it. I don't think general manager Ozzie Newsom would, would like it at all. Yeah. I think he comes from the Bill Belichick kind of mantra of less access, the better. You know, he doesn't want to open up the doors and let everybody see what's going on here in Baltimore with good reason. I yeah. mean, there's competitive advantage. I'm sure other teams are going to be watching as much as I would like to see it because it's really entertaining and as I'm sure fans would like to see it. I don't know that the benefit outweighs the potential negatives. So rather than focusing on hard knocks, fans should make sure they keep it here for all we of content. We have excellent videos yeah, here. Yeah, we exactly. Got, we got Insider the, stuff. We got all the access you need. <laughs> all those videos are going to be coming out throughout training camp. And always send us your questions on social media. We love to hear from you guys. Thanks for watching Mailbag today and have a great rest of your day.